Chloe Wyatt Taylor, media correspondent with Westlake Pro, and we are here with Mishka. Hi, nice to see you guys. <laughs> Hi, Mishka. What brings you out to the Pensado Awards tonight? Dave Pensado. Dave Pensado. He's like the uncle to every single one of us. We all, I mean, some of my first records were mixed by Dave, um, and he's always been the teacher that he is online. He was always the teacher that to all of us in person. He's, it's just always been who he is. Just a great soul. When is the first time that you remember hearing the name Dave Pensado? Um, first time, I, well, I grew up in a record store, so the first time I read the name Dave Pensado was probably mid-90s, Cameo, I think. I think it was a Cameo record. Um, yeah, he's just the best. And what brought you into the whole world of music in and of itself? Um, well, I, because I grew up in a record store, it just was in my blood, so... Um, I was an artist when I first moved out here and very quickly placed a song and um, from that I was discovered by Rodney Jerkins and um, uh, a couple months later I was in a studio with Michael Jackson and my life, life changed. So um, that's kind of what happened. I love how you say that. I just was and then I was in a studio with Michael Jackson. That's amazing. It's crazy because that's just the way it happened. You know, I was writing songs in my living room one day and uh, sent a song to Rodney, and Rodney loved it. And you know, a couple couple weeks later, I was on the phone with Rodney Jerkins and um, Tommy Mottola, mm -hmm. um, who at that time was the head of uh, Sony Music, mm -hmm. pretty much the head of music at that time. He was the the man. And they they both said, "Would you like to come to New York and write some songs?" And uh, a couple weeks later, I was in New York writing songs. So and it just never stopped. That's a dream come true. Um, it is a dream come true. I'm a very blessed person. Yeah. <laughs> and so now, what is one of the things that you're looking forward to most tonight? Um, just seeing Dave. You know, th these these are things. The awards are really kind of a way for all of us to pay tribute to Dave. He's paying tribute to everybody else, but really, we all love Dave. So it's really about paying tribute to, to you know, Trailblazer, mm -hmm. uh, a man who changed music. Mm -hmm. So. And then if you could say thank you to any one individual or any group of people, who would that be or what? Um, well, my wife, my grandmother for being the best grandmother. She owned the record store and she would always send me home with study material. So if there was a record that she didn't think I'd appreciated or hadn't heard, she would send me home with it and make me study it. So I would thank my grandmother, but I would always th thank Dave um, always thank Rodney Jerkins, you know, changed my life, and Michael Jackson. Well, well, yeah. yeah. Last question. As we are getting down and we're boogieing tonight, boogieing. what is that song that's going to get you up out of your seat? Oh, you, you've really got me in a, you've got me stumped. <laughs> I, I can't tell you. I'm sorry. <laughs> Fair enough. I don't know that I could tell you. <laughs> Thank you so much for stopping by the Westlake Step and Repeat. Ladies and gentlemen, this is Mishka. And I'm happy to be here. And he's happy to be here. And I'm Chloe Wyatt Taylor.